Corio Basic Machine Operations, BMO. What is Corio Machine Software? Corio is a suite of different machine software applications that are separated into two major groups. First is for technicians to interact with the machine to do such tasks as updating or reloading a controller board. Everything we're going to talk about is related to operators working with the machine. The first software we need to talk about is found in the systems tray called Corio Connect. Clicking on the Corio icon will open up a window showing you the established Ethernet communications from the PC to the machine. On the right side of the window is easy access icons for the most commonly used software an operator will use for daily production. We're going to talk the most about Corio Command. Corio Command is responsible for sending the motion commands from the PC down to the machine to execute. CNC files can be opened into command from the keypad or directly from any networked folder the PC has access to. Operators can quickly find out quite a bit of information about the CNC job in moments. Simply rotate the job and it shows you the number of passes. Having views selected to entity will show straight lines in blue and arcs in red. You can know information about the overall size and Z depth of the part being cut. Easily see the position of the job from 00, zero of the material corner. Clicking on table bounds view allows operator to see the position of job file in relation to the overall X and Y table boundaries. You can tell that this part is relatively small to the table size and the job file code is correct and eligible to be executed because it's inside of the min max stroke of the working area. Comparatively, if we open this other job file, then it shows the job size is well within the machine's maximum and minimum table size, but the job was output in negative stroke beyond the working table area. Trying to execute this job would create a simple out of bounds error at the keypad. I'm going to go back to the previous job and returning to a rotated view. Another very important feature of Corio command is while the machine is executing the job file, there will be a real time motion crosshairs on the screen showing the completed entity's code changed to bright yellow. My favorite feature of Corio command is graphical proximity restart of a job. Operators can easily move through a job file and establish exactly where you want to restart the job from. Pressing the execute button will allow the machine to skip all the previous work and begin exactly from the point selected. This is often used to save time from such events like a broken router bit. Operators replace the bit, calibrate the tool, and proximity restart at the job exactly where they need to. Corio Command has an edit tab that can be used to open the next job to be executed. Open job, rotate, and change views to Z depth. Operators can see that the blue is the shallowest cutting area and the red is the deepest cutting depth. All of these features Corio Command has makes interacting with the machine easy and informative. Finally, in the Corio Connect window, another application we should mention is Corio Report, which shows all the historical jobs executed at the machine. Report displays the job data history in a calendar and will allow a daily, weekly, monthly, or yearly summary report to be printed.